guys welcome back to vlogmas day 20 yes day 20 five more days until christmas how exciting so i believe we are back on track with our vlogmas video so i apologize for that mess that happened where my days were just out of order but i recently discovered because i've been having major exporting problems like my computer i have a macbook pro it will be plugged in but it won't charge because my Adobe Premiere Pro will use way too much energy. And then I found out since I switched to my new um, camera, my YouTube videos have been way over a gig. I have some videos that I'm now converting to a smaller file size, which won't damage the quality. I've got them from two gigs to seven gigs. I had one video that was like 19 gigs and I absolutely do not need a 19 gig video of a day in my life. So that's what I'm working on here on the side because it is kind of a slow process with the whole conversion. So that's gonna take some time. I at least wanna get the videos that are three gigs and up converted because the one or one and two gigs, there's not too many, uh, but that's just gonna take up a ridiculous amount of space in my external hard drive. Anyways, so here I am at work. I've got the V8 Energy Drink Black Cherry and Uncrustables again. It's just an easy breakfast to bring to work with me and I don't have to heat it up. I don't have to do anything. I literally just take it out of the freezer and then let it thaw out and it's perfect. But then sometimes I, if I want a Starbucks drink, then I will get a hot breakfast sandwich, but that doesn't happen all the time. So this is it for now. I do want to mention my hair though, because I really love how this looks with this length. I took a tapered wand, my pink tapered wand. It is one and a half inch to one inch and just did a few um, curls, not, too, not like deep curls, like this one looks a little deeper than this one. Um, but what I did was I just kind of looped it like once and then let the rest hang down. So I was just looking for a little bit of body to my hair. So now I'm in my car, I have an appointment and then afterwards I'm gonna go to lunch. So the next time I see you will probably be when I am home for lunch. And then we'll open some quirky Christmas cards. I haven't shown you yet, but here is my outfit of the day. I'm wearing my pink Nike Dunks, um, the bar sweatshirt, skims, it fits everybody leggings, very comfortable. Just checked the mail, home for lunch, and look at what we got from Chewy. I was like, I didn't thought I canceled my auto ship order, so this is something completely different. Let's open it up together. So this, I think it's T-R-E-A-T-S. So let me get the little opener thingy, the slicer. No, sit. All right, so these are Halo Holistic Biscuits with peanut butter and banana. Wow, this is so awesome. Oh, this one is oats and blueberries and pumpkins and peanuts. We've got all the flavors here. What else? We got this bakery pretzel bites with real peanut butter feeling, filling. So this looks like normal peanut butter pretzels, but Bia says four dogs. This other side, original bakery for dogs, savory woofers, chicken and apple flavors. This is so nice of them. And now here's an actual box. No, sit, sit. It is a bunch of, oh, more T-R-E-A-T-S, because my dogs can spell. And it looks like pet apparel. Wow. So let me try and give you a look. Check this out. So we've got some clothing. We've got two toys. And there are two things, two bags here. Got this. Oops, there you go. And then this one, little plates. That is so cool. There's no note at all. So I don't know how this happened, 
let's go ahead and open this. What if there is a note in here? I don't think there is though. No note. Yeah, I feel like if I didn't read this, I would think it's for humans. I'm sure you can eat it though. Oh yeah, we were gonna open this to see which one of them can actually wear it. What is it? Pet peril. It's a stocking, not an outfit. It says pet peril on the tag. That's why I thought it was clothing. This is so cute, Biggie. Biggie, isn't this adorable? Look, it's a stocking for you and Karma Girl. That's adorable. We were chosen and I feel so special. This is so cool. So I'm gonna set this up nicely so that I can share it and thank them. This is so exciting. I never get packages like this. Are you so happy, Biggie? Karma hasn't even seen it yet because she's terrified. Get back, Biggie, back. So here's a look at everything all laid out. This is so nice of them. I'm sure Biggie cannot control himself because he really can't. Okay, after that excitement, let's get back to our regular programming of opening some Corgi Christmas cards. Actually, this one is not just for Corgis, it's for the whole fam bam from someone here in town who I just realized her handwriting is just like my grandma's. Or it was like my grandma's. Merry Christmas. Check it out. It's cute. They have a dog too. This one comes from, did you love it? Texas. Texas, Biggie. Merry Christmas. What's a cute corgi. Happy holidays. Wishing you the bestest day with lots of treats, cuddles, and big old slobbery corgi kisses. Her name is Almond. 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 Next is, look at this cute sticker. This one comes from... Chattanooga, Tennessee. I wonder if this is wee little Winston. No, it's not Karma's birthday partner. Car Biggie. Happy holidays. Tell Santa we've been good. Sweet Sophie Pupper, it is. Sophie is actually, uh, I think, yeah. This Sophie is Karma's birthday partner. So we just sent her her gift not too long ago. The last Corgi Christmas card is from New York. There's something special in here. Enjoy this coloring sheet from Scamp and Family. I mean, they have corgi coloring sheets on Amazon, so this is what it looks like. And there's a cute little sticker. This one's adorable. This one says, best wishes for a Merry Christmas. There is one corgi in this family, and he is so small. Like, check him out right over here. That's it. That took up a lot of my lunch break, so I don't know what I'm going to eat. But it was all very exciting. Okay, so I'm in line at Starbucks because I was like, you know what, I might as well. Um, I'm going to get a drink. I want to get a snack. And one thing I don't understand is how can there be a hold up at a coffee drive through because you should only be getting coffee, maybe a snack and not even a coffee, like I don't drink coffee, so maybe just like a normal drink, but I've been sitting here. Like it just, I shouldn't be waiting this long, I feel like, something's up. I'm going to get a grilled cheese and a grande ice cream tea. Maybe with peach flavor, I don't know. Kind of like the peach flavor. Wait, what's we get for you? Hey, can I get the tomato and mozzarella sandwich? Um, I'm not sure if I have it. Let me check. Okay. So the tomato mozzarella? Yes. Looks like I found one. Anything else? And can I get a grande uh, iced tea lemonade? What one? Iced tea lemonade with green tea? Yeah, anything else? That's all. Perfect. I will see you. Oh wait, actually we're all out of lemonade. I completely spaced it. Oh, can I just get an iced green tea? Yeah, 9 thank you. Thank you. I uh, know, that's okay. Okay, 
I'm officially home. Biggie is happy, as you can see. And what about Karma Girl? Are you happy too? Are you happy too? Are you so happy? Beast? Piggy dog! Beast? Hello, babies. So pretty short vlogmas uh, episode today, but I'm going to go ahead and make dinner and then watch Survivor tonight. And the amazing race is over. So now my only show on Wednesdays is Survivor. All right, I'm gonna end it here. Thanks for watching, bye.